Hey Aries, welcome to your reading. If you're new, welcome. Please remember to subscribe and hit the notification bell so you get all the messages I post each month. I'll leave information about what decks of cards I use in the description box along with how to contact me for personal reading. So let's see. Okay, Zana, Celeste and Patience. Okay. You are protected from all types of harm. The worst is now behind you. I ask you to relax and feel safe, Celeste. A happy move to a new home or location of... In Sorry. <laughs> a happy move to a new home or place of employment is in the works. This move will usher in new energy. New positive energy. Patience. Now is the time to learn, study and gather information being a student because in the future you will synthesize the knowledge into action, okay? So don't worry about it if um, things aren't going as quick as you like. Have patience, okay? The more you learn, um, you know, the more it easier it is to move forward, right? But the worst of it is behind you. Uh, a new move to a home or a new job will bring in positive energy for you guys. So let's see what's going on here. The hermit, yeah. So this time you've had to yourself, um, what you've been waiting for, having to have patience, really was a time for you to learn, gather knowledge, soul search here. So it looks like you've been on this soul searching journey in the hermit mode there. And the worst of it is behind you. I see her, you know, a time is coming that we will be reflecting when Mercury goes retrograde. So we might be looking back, but look back with a positive experience like, okay, I overcame that. Don't look back and say, okay, that's when, you know, people left me and I felt my worst and, you know, look back and say, yeah, I got through that on my own and I'm proud of myself, you know, perspective here. And because you've had this time for soul searching, you're going to now move forward and be able to put all you've learned into action. Nine of Cups. So you'll find it easier to walk away from situations that no longer serve you. OK, but I do see you looking back to the past here. OK, in that Eight of Cups. That happens with the Eight of Cups. When we leave with the Eight of Cups, uncertain circumstances where love and emotion has been involved, we'll get to a point where we do look back here. Could be somebody looking back to you as well. King of Swords maybe here if you're dealing with maybe a air sign. or But all the signs will generally come out. Um, but yeah, maybe now it's a good time for a clear conversation. I see you, you know, at the top of your um, intellect or your learning. So, you know, now you've come out of this hermit mode. I see you ready to put it into action. You might want to put the, ho um, the cart before the horse here. So you might be wanting to rush, but just take your time, okay? Everything in divine timing. There is this good energy coming in for you really fast here. Somebody may have cut you off. Maybe even a Virgo cut you off here and was very cold in communication wise if that's the case somebody now wants to speak to you um like i said it's because mercury is going retrograde um ace of pentacles so we see an offer of commitment coming in an opportunity um with the ace of pentacles can be from somebody looking back from the past or you may feel like um you know i want to reach out to that person communicate um you know lay strong boundaries like what I've learned. I've learned to love myself, respect myself. And when they come in, I'm going to let them know I have a strong foundation now. I'm not who you left or I'm not who I used to be. Um, you know, I've grown. I've got like huge um, self-love and self-respect boundaries going on now that I'm not going to let um, somebody just come back in just for the sake of coming back in, just for the, maybe even the sake of love. It could be like, I love you. Um, I've always loved you. Maybe I always will love you, but I'm taking care of myself because you've learned a lot here and experienced a lot. So I don't feel like you are being cold towards people. I feel like you're putting into action um, your self-respect with the King of Swords, okay? But there is an opportunity coming up here with the Ace of Pentacles for commitment. You may want to slow it down with it being 
um, you know, pentacles there and that patience. She may be saying, look, you want to rush, but I just want to take my time and, you know, go one step at a time here. Surprising <laughs> for an Aries. Okay, five of cups, uh, you know, um, I've heard it all before that just straight away I was just about to even start singing until I caught myself. Um, I feel like you've just been through it before and that's why you was in hermit mode, that's why you was alone, that's why you chose to walk away. But somebody is missing somebody here. As we do have cross watchers, it may be somebody missing you, Aries, okay? So contemplation and definitely looking back on what was what you had maybe ships that sailed here maybe people that left you know but like I said look back it on it with an upbeat perspective like you know yes it is sad to let go but make way for new people to come into your life um, make way for people who are going to respect your boundaries who are going to love you fully uh, who are going to love you back even here, okay? So it's okay to have patience. Maybe you've been through all this and you feel like I'm at a stage where I'm ready for love now. And that's why they're telling you, look, have patience. Wait for the right offer. The world. So yeah, I see some cycles closing down as you look back. Um, you know, you putting some things to rest, to bed, um, and just looking out to your future, like, look, okay, that was sad, I experienced that, but I'm going to walk away and leave it in the past now, it's not serving me, I'm going to embrace new opportunities, even new people here with the world card. The hanged man, yeah, what, what was I saying all along, it's like this change of perspective, you're having this awakening you've been through you may feel like you stood still like okay I've been through all that now I've looked back I've worked it all out I've learned my lessons um why am I still stuck still patience dear one right the other person your soulmate who's coming towards you could be still learning certain lessons and you want somebody as awake as you right you want somebody on the same vibration somebody where you're at in life somebody ready to build Offer an Ace of Pentacles. So let's see here. Yeah, I feel like you're feeling good, Aquarius. Uh, sorry. Um, some of you and Aquarius may be coming towards you there with that King of Swords and me misspeaking there. So yeah, I feel like you're looking good, Aries. Nine of Pentacles. You may spend your time buying yourself new clothes and making yourself look good because Venus has got you feeling good, right? You know, getting back to yourself. And like I said, it's okay to reflect back to your past, but look back and say, yeah, look who I am now. Look how strong I am now. So don't look back and say, you know, I'm all alone. Um, because some of you could be doing that with the nine of pentacles. You know, feeling like, yeah, I've experienced all that. I've grown and I've learned, but I feel like all alone. I'm ready for love, but there's nobody here yet. If we look at it like... Um, just imagine you meeting the perfect one when you wasn't ready and then you losing them because you wasn't ready, right? Okay, so it's all about how we look at things here and how we're going to interpret life. I feel like you're ready to get back out there or something here. It's like realizing happiness is your right. Eight of swords here. So somebody could be heavily on your mind or you may be on he heavily on somebody's mind. I feel like more that you're on somebody's mind, Aries, okay, um, with the Eight of Swords. I think they're thinking about you a lot. And this is why we have to wait for everything to get in order. Um, somebody could be getting over something here. They may be depressed at this time and you're not depressed. So somebody who's not depressed and somebody who is depressed wouldn't necessarily work very good together, right? Um, some opposites do attract, but this person could just end up draining you and you don't want to repeat a cycle with the world card. So it's best that you wait for them to be in nine of pentacles energy as well and ready to, you know, build and create together. But I feel like it's somebody's just thinking about you because, you know, you're reflecting as well, um, that, you know... You, they're just thinking about you and what happened. It's just that time of year, unfortunately. Queen of Pentacles. So a great time to focus on business, um, self-employment, working for yourself, 
things that are creative, things that are nurturing to other people. Um, maybe getting a new job in service and service to other people. Maybe selling clothes or starting your own fashion business here. Um, if that's been heavily on your mind, put action into it and do it because with this positive move comes this positive energy. Looks like good money energy for you guys coming in right now with the Nine of Pentacles, Ace of Pentacles and Queen of Pentacles. So a good time to put energy behind your goals and future desires there. Good luck, guys.